Good afternoon, everybody. Hi. Here we are in New Orleans in the French Quarter. Mm -hmm. This came up kind of last minute mm -hmm. because we were trying to travel to other places, but the first thing other than traveling, our flights open as we check the weather. And right. the other weather was our, tell, baby. Our first choice was going to Mexico City this weekend. But tomorrow. But they're expecting heavy, heavy rain tomorrow. And thunderstorms tomorrow. So right. we're not there. And then we're going to go to some other places on the East Coast, but they're expecting the same thing. Yeah, so, yeah, like uh, Nashville, Memphis. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, we came to our favorite city, New Orleans. Mm -hmm. They do have some rain here, but we have a break in the weather right now. Uh -huh, and it's not supposed to rain tomorrow, which is really good. It's supposed to be partly cloudy, maybe a sprinkle here and there, but that's about yeah, it. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So we're here for two nights. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna get down and party mm -hmm. like our usual. And first thing we're gonna do now is go have a drinky, baby. Yeah, we're gonna go. There's a place uh, here at our hotel. Mm -hmm. We're staying at the Prince Conti. Yeah. It's called Bombay. Yes, the Bombay Club. Yeah. Uh, we don't know how dark it is in there, but it looks pretty cool and they're known for the martinis. So we're gonna go try that out, babe. Okay, let's do it. Here we are. Welcome to the Press Conti. We've stayed here before. At the French Quarter. At the French Quarter. And this is one of our favorite places to stay. So here has a safe and a fridge. Uh -huh. Has your little coffee machine. This little small closet there. Okay. And, and this one is your restroom. Okay. Nice and modern looking. Mm -hmm. This is the bedroom. Or a bedroom. That's your room. Right. Just nice. Frame the TV mm -hmm. and a little view. Not much, just a building next door. But we can see whether or not it's raining anymore. Yes, exactly. It's perfect. Yep. Nice beds. Prince Conti. Mm -hmm. Our hotel, that was the driveway where we just got. This is our hotel right here. Right. And then right in here is the bomb bacon. Here it is. Okay, we got our uh, martinis. I have like a, uh, it's called a Nova Star. Oh my god, I have cho cho chocolate. Yeah, it's kind of like apple. Cheers, man. Cheers, babe. Good martinis. Oh, that was strong. I had, we switched. And so yeah. he had my chocolate teeny, and then I had his. I need something to eat. Yeah, yeah. you feel a little bit of it right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah. Right? And this is only one drink. Yeah, yeah. Very good martinis. How much yes. was with, for it? It was the uh, 24 bucks. 24 so, bucks. Yeah. And yeah. they're specialized in martinis here. Yeah. Very good. You're going to enjoy it. The atmosphere is awesome. Yeah, very classy. Um, Jeremy classy. is our bartender. He's awesome. He has great recommendations for food around here. So come and see Jeremy. Yeah. So we're going to get some uh, some grub now. Yeah, yeah I need some NED. Okay. okay. This is bourbon during the day. It's almost, well, it's only like 6 o'clock or so maybe if I were lucky. Yeah, yeah, no, plus, it's not even. It's 5.30. Yeah, plus it just finished raining so it's yeah. not too many people here. These are by far the best oysters that I've tried. I've really traveled all over the world and these are the best ones. Uh, they have me jaded. This is the ones I want. Here we go, the raw one. Mm. The oyster is so nice and so fresh. Not a big oyster taste. They're actually a little bit sweet. And this cocktail sauce is mixed with their bird dryers, which is amazing. Here we go. My favorite, the char grilled oysters. We just literally had some char grilled oysters last week in Las Vegas. Acme here in New Orleans is reigned as a king. Yes. Acme Oyster House. Yes, we just had our appetizer. Yep. Right? Yeah, all we had were the oysters. Grilled. Yeah, so uh, we're ready to get some uh, now dinner food. now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so yeah, we highly recommend Acme Oyster House again. Yes, you, it's you heard it a lot. So hard to come to New Orleans and not go to the same places you've already eaten, but we're gonna make it our our mission to go to different places. It is yeah. so hard. But this place yeah. cannot skip. Oh my god, it's, it's a must stop. Yeah, yeah, it is. Yeah. So our next spot is more of our dinner spot. We're again gonna share our meal because we want to maybe something a little bit later, huh, baby? That's right. Yeah. That's right. Let's okay. go, baby. Let's go. 
So it's only like six o'clock and yeah. it's getting a little bit crazy it's already. Crazy's out here already. Right? I, the streets are still open, so the still coming down and we're standing in the middle of the street. Talking about crazy people. That's your idea. <laughs> So how much was that uh, gumbo? Babe? Uh, 11 bucks. 11 bucks. 11 bucks yeah. Oh, and uh, back at the Acme Oyster House? That was 34. Okay, yeah. That... Two beers, two beers, and a half dozen of char grilled and a half dozen of raw. Yeah. 34 bucks. Oh, yeah. Yeah, with the two beers? Good, perfect. That was perfect. Now, that was our appetizer. This one we kind of just kind of stopped because we like their gumbo. Yeah. But now we're actually heading to Fallberg, which is their best catfish sandwich. I don't know if we're going to have that. Are we going to have that one for today, baby? I think so. It's pretty awesome. It's, yeah, we're going to share that one. It is so pretty we can awesome. Have, so we, uh, we can grab something a little later, maybe. Got it. Alrighty, let's go. You're talking really fast. Oh, it's the alcohol. It's the booze. A couple blocks away from Bourbon Street yeah. is the uh, what is the 700 Club? Yeah, which right inside the club, which like a lot of these bars have inside, is an eatery called Fallberg Bistro. Mm -hmm. So like a lot of the bars here, they have the bar in the front and then the bistro is in the back, or their eatery is in the back. Yeah, we came here once before and they had some uh, awesome. awesome eats. Awesome. Yeah, eats we here. don't like catfish and they have the awesome catfish. They do. They do. Let's so go inside. he's in the mood for that. Yeah. This is the same load of fries we had last time here. It's ridiculous on um, how big this is. It's like it's bigger than his head. It is. Yeah. It's much bigger than yeah. my head. Yeah. All right, go ahead for the mac and cheese. This is what I wanted to try out here, the five yeah. cheese mac and cheese. Yeah, first time here, right? First time yeah. getting this here. Mmm. Creamy. The mac and cheese, the noodles are cooked perfectly. It is creamy. It's very good tasting. Yeah. You can taste the difference in the cheese, but there's no like sharp taste of one particular cheese. It's just really good. They have this like crunchy topping to it. I'm not sure what it is. Probably some sort of crumbs or like breadcrumbs or something that goes on top of the mac and cheese. It's really good. Mm. Order for the catfish. Very good. No words needed. No words. No words, baby. Tasty, that was it. Great sauce. Pretzel bun is nice and soft. You got the crunch of the fresh vegetables in here. Not spicy at all. A little bit of the Creole taste seasoning to it. My favorite catfish sandwich of all time. That was a good meal. Good meal. We ordered too much food. Always. We always order yeah, too much. Yeah. I mean, uh, I thought we, he wanted the fries with the uh, fish sandwich, but he wanted the fries or the mac and cheese. Yeah, but so, you know, it was good. It was good. Uh, obviously, we couldn't even crack half of it. Yeah. But we can't take it because we have no refrigerator or microwave. Well, we do have a we fridge, have fridge, but we have but no microwave. We have so many other things to try, though. Yeah, exactly. So, uh, so we we're just getting tired. I'm getting tired, so I need a drink. Huh, baby? Yeah, we can't poop out yet, babe. No, yeah. I know. We get here early for a reason, not to poop out. That's right. Yep. That's right. So we're going to go for a walk down Bourbon yeah. Street now. We made it mm. to our purple drink, Lafayette Blacksmith. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Got our purple drink. It's a must, right? Mm -hmm. It's a must. Let's go walking. Uh, oh, I think you forgot to mention how much the food was at the oh, uh, place. Oh, Cowbirds. Yeah. How much was that? 20... I forgot, baby. I forgot. $22, maybe? Yeah, somewhere mm -hmm. between 22 and 25 Yeah. Uh, these were the same, $9 each? Mm-hmm. They were the 
it hasn't happen. changed in years. No, they're coming down here. It's hard to see because they're having the construction down here now. So it's hard to see this place, but if you go past the construction, you'll see the crowd outside. Yeah. So, definitely. Yep. Let's go enjoy this, baby. Okay. Your favorite blues band is here. My favorite singer is here tonight. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. But uh, yeah, so that was a cool night, and we'll see you guys in the morning.